Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. Today I thought that I'd do a little bit of a day in the life and show you all what my life has been like now that we're in shelter in place. So it's Friday right now and it's 8.54 in the morning. We're just about to join a VTA special meeting. Starting in five minutes. But I'm gonna switch over to Zoom soon so that I can actually comment. So I just finished with the meeting. It's currently 11.07. It actually went by a lot faster than I thought that it would. So I was good and my Zoom worked this time. So I was actually able to make a public comment. So now I think I'm gonna make some food because I still haven't had breakfast yet. I don't really have anything interesting to eat so I'm not gonna record what I'm making. So it's about 12.40 now and I have a Zoom meeting at one. So I thought that I would just come in here and get ready a little bit and make myself look a little bit more normal because I definitely fell into the habit of just wearing pajamas and hoodies all day. I already did my eyebrows after I brushed my teeth this morning, but since I'm bored and I don't have anything else to do, I'm just going to tell you what eyebrow products I use in case you care. As you've probably seen in my videos, I don't like to make my eyebrows look like super blocky and dark. I like to make them look pretty natural. But my eyebrows are naturally really sparse. So this is like a close-up for people that care. My eyebrows aren't really that great, but they're better than they were in the past. The first product that I use is the e.l.f. Ultra Precise Brow Pencil in the shade Cool Brown. The reason that I use this is because the color works really well with my hair color. And it has a really nice fine tip. This works really well if you want your brows to look more natural. And I buy this at Target but I think you can also get it at Walmart or Ulta. The second product the second product that I use is the ColourPop Brow Boss Gel in the shade Soft Black. Comes with a little spoolie thing, and then you just kind of brush it through your eyebrows and it, and it makes them a little bit darker. I buy these at Ulta. I think this and the pencil are both less than $7. I'm not really gonna do anything else makeup-wise because as you can probably tell, I've gotten really, really pale from being inside, so, so I don't really have anything that matches my skin color right now. But I am gonna do my hair, because it doesn't really look that good right now. As you saw in the beginning of the video, I wet down my hair, and then it dried naturally during the meeting. If you've seen some of my other videos where I do my hair, so I would use a blow dryer and this brush, and like make my hair really tall. But my hair is way too long now, and it doesn't really stand up, and even if I got it to stand up, it would look really ridiculous. So I'm just gonna put some product in it and do a little side part. This is the product that I use, it's Han Sepuko Quick Sand. I've probably used this in every single video. I've been using this stuff since I was 18 um, and I love it. So I'm just gonna take a little bit out. It's about this much and rub it in my hand and then just put it in my hair. I haven't been doing my hair every day during shelter in place, but on the days that I do do my hair, this is what I do. I just use the product and just shape it in the right direction um, and just kind of try to give it some volume. This is what my hair looks like. I feel like I look a lot older when my hair is up than when I have bangs. So this is how I've been styling my hair, especially when I have meetings and stuff. Because I already look really young and I really don't like it when people treat me like I'm even younger than I look. I am planning on getting my hair cut how it was before when I can actually go to my normal hair cutting place again. For now, the top of my hair is just gonna be long and I'm just gonna have to deal with it. So I'm ready for my meeting now and I'm gonna go and get everything set up for that. So it's about 4.30 now. I had two Zoom meetings. They went pretty well. I'm kind of getting to a point where I'm tired of Zoom, but there's not really any other way to communicate with people. I have another meeting in a couple hours. So I'm probably just gonna watch some YouTube until then. It's quite a bit later now. It's about 9.15 or so. And I just got done with my last meeting. It wasn't a really formal meeting, but it was a pretty casual meeting with of my transit friends and we're just talking policy. So it was really good to catch up with everybody and see what everybody's up to. I'm really thankful that we have technology and we can talk to people on Zoom now. But I just really miss all of my friends and I really want to talk to them and see them in real life. So hopefully I can do that soon. But yeah, so I think I'm going to end the video here. I'm probably just going to go for a walk and then go to bed. So this is kind of an average day in my life during shelter in place. Thank you all so much for watching. Let me know what you did today down in the comments below. Stay awesome and I'll see all of you very soon with a new video. Goodbye.